Hey everyone, quick video today on how to put your Mazda with electronic parking brake into maintenance mode so you can safely work on your rear brakes. If you are replacing your pads or rotors, or pads and rotors, you will need to do this to push your caliper piston back to accommodate the extra width from the new pads and or rotors. First things first, from the car off, Press your start button twice, turn into on mode, and right now our parking brake is currently disengaged. You are now going to push on the accelerator, and you're going to push it to the point where you feel that click in your foot. You're going to hold the electronic parking brake button down, and then you're going to press the start button three times quickly, and what we're going to hear after that is the... Uh, electronic parking brake motor is retracting and you're going to see a yellow uh, warning light with a P and an exclamation mark. So ready? Foot, button, one, two, three. Of course that didn't work. Let's try it one more time. One, two, three. Okay, hopefully you heard those motors retracting. The reason why that didn't work is because I let go of the gas pedal and the parking brake button before they started retracting. So let's not do that. Okay, let's say we've now worked on our brakes. The car is currently off. We're going to turn it on with two button presses. Okay, we've got this light here. The yellow P with the exclamation mark. Again, foot down past the click this time you're going to push the emergency or electronic parking brake button up and then the same one two three one two three hopefully, hopefully what you just heard was them engaging and adjusting and now our parking brake is working like normal and the warning light is gone. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Thank you.